Greetings, Dennis Daniels here. This is a quick tutorial on how to use G-Code tools and Inkscape. First thing we're going to do is create a simple stencil. I'll write test. Actually, let's go with the traditional hello world. And what I'll do is, this is my workaround for figuring it out. It doesn't necessarily always work. Object ungroup. Let's see, control A, object, un, ungroup, sorry, all right, and now it didn't work, so let's try the object to path, that didn't work either, let's try again, object to path, nope, stroke to path, nope, stroke to path, yet, all right, so yesterday it worked, and now it's not. Ah, there we go. Okay, so now you can see that each one of the objects has its own has its own highlight. And now let's try stroke to path. Normally, should get some indication that there's some lines around it. Now let's try the extensions, G-Code Tools. This is the latest 1.7. I'm going to run Engraving. And I click, make sure it's in, uh, you're in the Engraving tab. Click Apply. Operation points have not been defined. The result have been uh, created. OK. And now you should get this green, this green, uh, text that essentially is the information that the CNC device needs. Now we file save as, actually let's take a look at the name of the file. The name of the file was sent to the home directory output ngc. So we need to go find the home directory and since this is in Russian, I will have to st stumble around a little bit to find the home directory. Windows is Windows Home. Uh, no, Windows is not home. So let's go ahead and change that directory because I will spend hours trying to find it. Let's click Apply. And now, click OK. Oh, I chose graffiti. Sorry. Close. I want extensions, G-code tools, engraving, preferences. OK, it went to D. So that's where it should be. Apply. Click OK. Close. And now we go to the D drive. D. And there it is. Output G NGC. Now, I'm going to open show you the file in terms of what's inside and now what is written here is also written here to a certain extent some of the some of the details are written in this are written here let me just do a search nope that didn't work it's interesting that this shows up but not in the GN NGC file. No matter. Now what we can do is we're going to load this NGC file into OpenSCAM. Go to the desktop and OpenSCAM. In a moment, we have the option to load. And then we go to the D drive. And the most recent file is going to be the one we want. Output NGC. Click Open. And now <clears throat> you can see that we have a hello world file. And we can see that it's, let's rotate it. It's going to be in reverse because it's an engraving. And the red lines indicate the travel, and the green lines indicate the, there we're, there's the hello world. The green lines indicate where the cutter is going to be. This is a very quick and dirty demonstration. I hope to do a better one soon, but I hope that helps you and other people in the future. You can see the cutter is traveling 
in the simulation and doing the cuts for the engraving. Thank you for your time and happy computing.